Wells has passed. Where shall I take his remains? What? The Excelsior package provides for the disposal of passenger remains free of charge. I merely require a destination. I want to be with his family. Mr. Wells' closest blood relative is Guadalupe Alejandra Wells, proprietress of the El Coyote Coho Bar. I will make sure to deliver him safely. Mr. Deshaun awaits you in room number 204. See you in the major leagues, Jack. Waiting. WNS, N54, even the pirate networks. You blowing up everywhere. And the Jackster, he out in the car? We return to this week's biggest story. The murder of Arasaka Corp. Yeah, he's there. CEO, Dead. Arasaka. The longtime head of the Japanese mega corporation was reported condolences friend of the Konpeki plot and the relic the hotel while attending a family gathering Saburo Arasaka's son Yarinoko got it right here has cast blood hmm. for his I was afraid of that company's rivals what although he has not yet Saburo Arasaka dead you got any notion of the shit you pulled me into you off the fucking emperor his majesty Anyone with so much as a pinky toe dipped in this mess is as good as dead! Gotta leave Night City. You don't say. Ring Evelyn. We close the deal, collect our cut, and drop off the radar. Alright, settle down. Gotta be tactical about this. Parker, Eddie's. Then we leave the city limits behind. But first, your face got blood all over it. Bathroom's there. Go get yourself cleaned up. Can't risk it, V. Remember our first convo? Seems Dex, I've chosen what a the quiet fuck? life after all. No blaze of glory for me.
Tonight, I'm... I'm here to say goodbye to all of you. Change your mind. Want to see me give up? Sounds like something you'd do. Know why? Because you've always been a fucking pussy, Carrie. Offer you one piece of advice for old time's sake. Stop being one. Time to bring on the future. Shut down. Maybe seize on the streets of Watson. Sons of bitches. Skull cracking out there. That us? Johnny's idea. Wayland's drawing Aristotle's attention away from the tower. Collateral damage part of the plan, too. This is the Cub Scouts, Thompson. Chew it up, spit it out. on the elevator, arm it, let gravity do its thing. Explosion rocks the foundation, tower crumbles, chaos, screaming roll credits. Exit window's gonna be tight. <sighs> Jacking in.
rocks the foundation, town crumbles, chaos, screaming roll credits. Exit window stacking in. Is grass green? Do birds fly? Do cats eat bats? Do rats shit gnats? Mainframe's not your playground, Murphy. Come on. Evac announcement. Broadcast it across all frequencies and let's get moving. Sheesh. Who wrote this manifesto? Really need me to answer that question? Jesus, Johnny. You've gone off the deep end. That's coming from a chair jock. Come on! Get ready! Get that oh. Burn down! Get mine! Take that position! She thought it with care, pursued it with forks and hope. Johnny, Halo. Bushido 2, bomb's name is what? Wrap it up! We got a Delta! The Demolitron. We're good to blow. Shaka Elite incoming! Out of there, Run Johnny. for it! Shoot the cables! Now done yet. Still need to feed this to their subnet. I fucking knew it! This was never about corporate colonialism. This was about your groupie output, wasn't it? No, you wouldn't understand, Rogue. Giving you four fucking minutes. Chopper's not gonna wait one sec longer. Door lock breached. Arasaka's sons of bitches incoming. Love you, Spider. All world loves me. Oh. We've got heavy casualties. Closing in on the access point. Slot in. Sweet icebreaker. Foreign, right? Just wonder if we know anyone who can switch the subnet protocol. Hilarious. You gonna help or not? Do spiders spin webs? It's time we caught some flies. Thanks, Murph. Now, just for good measure. Holy cyber cow. We're on TV. Take we a look. turn now to Arasaka Tower. It's evacuation ongoing after an unidentified terrorist organization released a manifesto threatening violence. The terrorists stating their desire to, quote-unquote, topple a monument to corporate colonialism. Night City's mayor, Mbole Ebunike, has issued a statement declaring that he will bring the full force of the law to bear in response to any act of terrorism. Going now to our reporter on the scene at Arasaka Tower. Hopefully he can shed some light on the situation as events unfold. All set. Now get out of there. They're moving up. Hit the roof quick. Johnny boy, told you I'd end you someday. Hey, 
まだ生きていますわかりました向かいます Let us try once more. You associates, who are they? How did you acquire fistful material? Gonna give good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. <sighs> Which terrorist organization do you belong to? How did you acquire fistful material? <sighs> Hey, Gramps. I know you. Azusi. Jokusetsu hanashi o suru. Ah, damn. Done and gone. My husband died in that tower. But there are fates worse than deaths. I didn't want him to die. Naze, kono yona koto. Why did you do this? To bring an end to the madness you. リック。人は嘘つき、自分自身を欺く。だが、社は違う。社は有弁だが、彼らは決して嘘をつかない。死者の言葉には慎ましさがある。始めろ。And you, who are you?
Ugh, heavier than he looks. Now, listen, dog. I have done exactly what you asked. So let's you and me figure this out. あらさかさま、お父様の殺害犯を見つけました。はい。はい。一時間後には着くかと。Help me. They are faint again. Keep your eyes open. Fuck. We both could use medical attention. Do you know a Reapadoc whom you can trust? I know. Someone. We must get to Ripadok. Quickly! Victor... will... fix... us up. We have to get there somehow! Call someone! Anyone! All right, all right! Greetings. My scanner indicates you are outside the service area. Just come. Pick me up. Need to get to Misty's esoteric 
front of Vix. Of course. A vehicle is en route. It should arrive in less than 20 minutes. What are you doing? Hey! The personal link is damaged. Please proceed to insert the jack below the ear, though not too deep. There should be auxiliary neurosockets between his lymph nodes, beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit a vein by mistake, he will die. Indeed, as he will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now proceed to connect. I cannot hold it. I need to rest. That your blood? Misty! Pressure's tanking! It's neurogenic shock. He's dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. There is risk of... I know what I'm doing. This is ultimately to defend the well-being of my family and my employees. That is why I have decided to double the amount of our active Night City security forces. President Myers has called this a breach in the Army Accord. Provocation targeted at the NUSA and Militech. Tell me then, what do we call the murder of... How is he? Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. You in there? Ah! My head. How you feeling? I don't know, Vic. Ears are ringing. And I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage and I almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of hatred. Then I let it all out into a mic, and I realized it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then, <laughs> promise not to laugh, I plant a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Nothing there to laugh about. They killed me, Vic. Never been so afraid. It was too real, even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. As a personality construct on that shard, dreams you had were from his past. Saying I experienced another psyche's memories? How's that possible? 
You two are connected in a way I can't make head or tail of. Two? Me and who, Vic? <laughs> Who's the other? Johnny Silverhand, a terrorist. Real talk of the town back in my day. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. What is? The biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much... life. A few weeks, tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness. Gradually taking over your body until... one day you'll just be... gone. V, it's important you get all this. You'll fix me up, right? Vic? If I could, I would, V. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? I have to die. I am going to die. That's what you're saying. Prove it. Hmm. Dex shot you, right? The bullet damaged your chip slot and your brain. The biochip revived and short-circuited you. It started uploading data into your head. As far as it was concerned, your brain was an empty vessel that needed to be filled by the engram it was carrying. Empty vessel? But I'm right here. All of this is me! The shard doesn't read, it writes. Headache of yours? It's the biochip rewiring your neural pathways, building new neural structures, and doing away with the old. From where the shard's sitting, you, what's left, it's all a tumor that needs to be excised. Vic, you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... Well, what the hell do I do? Tell me, please. Vic. I wish I knew, kid. Misty. You're asking too much from an old-timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. And then he died. And I thought I was gonna die. With him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here. Got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudoendotrizines from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. I gotta lie down. Here, got one more thing for you. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? 
Promise you'll try to get some sleep. You're lovely, Misty. Thanks. Good night, V. Sweet, peaceful dreams. Get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way, you included. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? Where'd you even come from? How are we even talking? How the fuck should I know? The fuck kind of joint toy are you supposed to be? Fucking ghost off! You work for, start talking. Fuck. Fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No way. <laughs> Never, asshole. Now like that! Stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger! Oh. I can I feel, feel it. it. Our minds oh. touch them. I'm like I'm mold like on fruit, fruit creeping, creeping into you. Nothing, nothing I can, I can do, do about, about it. it. You hear me? I'd I puke, puke if, if I, I fucking fuck could. could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out I'm there out somewhere. somewhere. Gotta be. Thank you. 
Takemura here. We must meet. Come to Tom's diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Sit. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. What's it you actually want from me? To begin. You must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorinobu Arasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. Been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Suspect so, yeah. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness you get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? <sighs> Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Be, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip. The relic is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prep for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. Hanako sama, oai tekete koei desu. Kochira koso. Now. Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? 
You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there. Rogue. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Yorinobu Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. That Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Try ours today. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make it like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't watch it dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. 
Rogel danced any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us.